If there's no space, you can use like a lighter color to go on top of that. Or if it's an area that's a little lighter, you can use a darker color so that'll make your name pop out to create that contrast. Does that make sense? Adam is local, and I like for our students to be aware that art is everywhere, especially in their own local environment. And so that's something that they can, can see. If they wanted to look up Adam's work, they could do that. That's what's really cool. So whenever we see graffiti, it's always different colors, different shapes and styles and stuff like that. That's because they're just making it up as they go along. And they're like, they're just trying to be as creative as possible. And that's what I want to encourage you guys to do. Not just when you're working on the mural, but just when you're creating art in general. Just try to be creative. How can I do this in a way that nobody else does it? You know what I mean? I thought that it was important to have Adam here because he's a person that they can relate to. I think he's young, his heritage is very similar to many of our Hispanic students, and we really need male role models in the elementary schools. And he's uh, a captivating person, and the students have really related well to him. The plan is that e every student at Slate Hill will at least put a little bit of paint, which everybody's been able to put a little more, which is nice. Um, so everybody's been getting hands-on on the project. And the way it's been designed, um, it's, that has worked. And again, Adam has worked really carefully to ensure that that's possible with the design and, and the concept of the way it's, it plays out. They told me about the seven virtues which are taught here. So I decided to make this factory where a little girl's walking through one end and the different machinery in the factory are the different seven virtues and she pops out as a superhero. To try to encourage the kids when they apply these principles in our lives, we become better people. I'm lucky that I get to be able to do something that I'm passionate about, so I'm hoping that through this process I'm able to tell the kids that you can do this too. Like you can, if you believe in something and if you work hard enough at it, you can live your dreams, I guess. <laughs>